Meghan Markle and the royal baby Archie have brought media attention to the House of Windsor that has been unprecedented, they have also helped to bring an extra £1 million last year due to increased tourism. A spokeswoman for the Royal Collection Trust confirmed today that there had been an increase in visitor numbers to Windsor over the past year, although exact figures have yet to be released. The spokeswoman said, the increase in visitors could be due to a number of factors including increased interest following the royal weddings, an increase in inbound tourism due to the weak pound and the hot summer we experienced last year. This year's Sovereign Grant report revealed that the royal household earned roughly £8.9 million, £6.9 million from tourism during this year, the year of the birth of Meghan Markle's baby Archie. The past year has been filled with milestones for the British royal family. There have been weddings and births, and a few christenings and international tours in between. All those headlines and celebrations came alongside a major increase in visitors to royal residences, which in turn meant a rise in funds for the royal household. Numbers released today in the annual Sovereign Grant report show that £6.9 million or roughly $8.9 million was paid to the royal household from the Royal Collection Trust. The Royal Collection Trust manages exhibitions in royal residences, in the fiscal year ending March 2019. This figure is up from £6 million from the previous year, April 2017 March 2018. In the 2017 to 2018 fiscal year, 1.48 million people visited Windsor Castle. Weddings can provide multiple occasions on which to visit a palace. Following Harry and Meghan's wedding in May of 2018 at St. George's Chapel, their outfits went on display in Windsor Castle for several months, beginning in October. That same exhibit recently moved to the Palace of Holyrood House in Scotland. Similarly, after Princess Eugenie and Jack Brooksbank wed in October of last year at the same venue, their outfits were featured in the Windsor Castle exhibition starting in March of 2019. Buckingham Palace is also open to visitors from July to September every year. The Royal Collection Trust pays the facilities management charge to the Royal Household for services provided in connection with admitting the public to the exhibitions. All of that is added to the funds the Queen can spend in a year. Weather, weddings, and currencies may all have played a role in this year's increase in profits.